we're just two moms. We're expert contributors to FamilyAffairs.com. I'm Christy. And I'm Debbie. And today we're going to talk about the grass is always greener. Mm -hmm. A little hard for Debbie and I to talk about. We both have successfully packed up children and sent them to college, which can be difficult. Mm -hmm. Which means that I have one child left at home and Debbie... I've got zero. So for yeah. me, I see the grass is always greener. I see Debbie is now footloose and fancy free. Her house is very clean. I've been over there. Only one room. No. <laughs> but I'm still at home with a child who cannot be left at home alone, um, which is still very challenging. I really, you know, depended on my daughter to help me out a lot with my son, and it's definitely changed our family dynamics. Yeah. Um, our dynamics have changed abruptly, too. Right. I mean, yes, my grass might be a little greener, even though I don't use chemicals on my lawn, <laughs> however... Um, you know, I am waiting with bated breath with phone calls and Skype right now to hear that things are going really well for my son in college, which I could not be more thrilled and proud of. Um, do I worry? Yes, I worry all the time. Um, you know, are things going to continue? Will he still need supports? Will he be able to leave his dorm room? It's, it's a lot of social stuff that... I think typical parents would not even consider or think of right. and you know we are getting reports here and there that are concerning but we're we we now know that there are issues that we can work with either on the phone or skyping he's very coachable we've we've been very fortunate for that so that's a, a blessing and the supports in the school that he's going to are phenomenal and he's open to those supports which all of those things if right. you didn't have one piece of that um, I think we would be in a different situation. So I'm very blessed to say that, you know, my husband and I really feel that this is the right placement for him. And I think he's going to thrive and do very, very well and show his talents very soon if he hasn't already. So Right. But we're talking in general. I mean, a lot of people kind of have that envy mm -hmm. about um, either a child moving on or not moving on with typical peers. Mm -hmm. And that can be really difficult, especially um, if your child is really severely impacted mm -hmm. with a special need and you know that they'll never leave home. Or if they do leave home, it'll be to a group home um, after they're 21. And that can be really challenging. I remember someone saying, you know, it's difficult for me to see posts where people are going on to graduation and prom and college when they knew that that would not be something in their child's future. So um, the grass is not necessarily greener on the other side. It might look like that from a distance, but we're here to tell you that um, you may be challenged with what you're going through, but the people that you see with the green, green grass are mm -hmm. also challenged as well. 